So I recently had someone try to hack into my Instagram account. And luckily I had a couple of things turned on inside of my settings that prevented them from doing that. So I wanted to make this quick video to show you exactly how to protect your Instagram account from anyone trying to hack it. First, make sure your Instagram app on your phone is updated. I've already updated mine. Then jump into the profile page on your Instagram account and press the three lines over here. And then we want to go to the settings on our Instagram page. And there's a whole menu here for security. That's basically where we're gonna change a few different settings. First, if you think your account is compromised, you should go to login activity right here. Let me show you what this shows you. Here, it will show you if someone else logged into your account. So make sure you say this wasn't me, if this wasn't you. And then when you do that, you will have to log out and change your password. So again, make sure you review this page. Then I'm gonna go back. And then I jumped over here and I changed my password. Okay, that's the next step that I recommend. But to keep your account secure, you need to make sure you have two-factor authentication turned on. Let me go here. And there's multiple ways you could do this. I have it set to text messages, but it is recommended that you use an authentication app. Microsoft and Google have different apps in the App Store that basically show you a code that disappears every minute or so. And this is probably the best way to do this, but you could do text message and you could also set up additional methods. So you have options over here as well. And lastly, there's this option called emails from Instagram. If someone sends you an email saying to reset your password, for example, you should come here before you do anything to see if Instagram sends you an email because they will send you emails and they will notify you on this page if they did send you an email. If an email came from someone else, it wouldn't appear over here, okay? So a lot of phishing scams are done that way and they pretend to be Instagram and they're not. So come onto this page and make sure there's nothing here from Instagram. And even with all that, I still change my password every few months just to make sure there are no issues since I use Instagram for my business. I hope you found this useful. Please give it a thumbs up and I'll see you next time.